Hey everyone, welcome back. I am the Electrical Code Coach, and this is the electrical question of the day. Using non-metallic sheath cable, NM, Romex, what is the maximum number of number 12 conductors allowed in a standard 4-inch octagon box without plaster rings that has a depth of 1.5 inches? And the correct answer is 6. And I love the way that this question is worded because it's just like they do in the actual exams. It's full with a ton of useless information. Now, it does have a lot of very useful information, but we don't need to know if it's non-metallic sheath cable. We don't need the point of it saying without plaster rings because in the absence of that language, we would just assume that there is no plaster ring. And they love to fill your question with lots of useless information to either waste time or to get you to second guess yourself. But let's go ahead and look at what we're talking about today. Of course, we're looking at box fill. And this is the specific box that we're talking about in this question. This is an octagon box. This is an inch and a half deep octagon box that you'll use out in the field, usually for lighting outlets. And for this one, we're going to head to 314.16a. It's actually a table, and it's one of my favorite tables because it's easy to read. Those are my favorite ones. On the left-hand side of this table, it, it talks about our box size. This is where we get all of our dimensions. Today, it's a four by inch and one half. Then this next column of the table lists our type of boxes. It lists round and octagonal boxes. Then it lists four square boxes, four and 11 sixteenths boxes, and then device boxes, a bunch of different types of metal boxes that we're used to using out in the field. And across the top, we read that this is our maximum number of wires if they're all of the same size. So if you have all 10s or all 12s, you can actually use this little cheat sheet table right here to make it even easier. You would start on the left-hand side and find your box size, which ours is four by one and a half. Then you come to the type of box, which ours falls under the octagonal section. Then we're going to come across until we find 12 gauge wires. Now on this top line is where all the different gauges are listed. And then when you come down here, it tells you the physical number of wires. So we went from box size to box type, then across the top and found 12 gauge. And then we come down and we tee off with that number. And we find today that it's six conductors. Great job. I am the Electrical Code Coach, and my bargain is that these videos will add value to you, and you will in turn add value to others. I want to let you know that you can do it. Just keep fighting. Whatever you're working for, whatever level you're trying to push through and get to the next level, you can do it. I'm in your corner. I've got your back. If there's anything you need from me, you can always email me at electricalcodecoach at gmail.com or just shoot me a text anytime at 423-895-3247. I always get back to everybody as quick as I can, and if I don't get back to you in a reasonable amount of time, just text me again. You're never going to be a bother. When I can't answer, I do. When I can't answer, I don't. Let's get to it.